Hey, you guys still alive? I thought I was gonna die and... Uh, hey! Will you let go already? <clears throat> <gasps> Sorry! Not again. What was that sound? Hmm? W what are you guys doing out here? Reminds me, where's Futaba? What about Futaba? Oh... Uh, yes! We came all this way, so how about we enjoy some coffee? Oh, that's a great idea! That's fine, but... Uh, I'm not thirsty, though. <clears throat> oh, I almost forgot. I have some business to take care of, so you guys go on ahead. Okay, gotcha. Let's go see Futaba. Futaba? Can you hear me? Please say something! Please! Could this be our fault? Is it because we defeated her monstrous mother? No. That was nothing more than a cognitive being created in her mind. Destroying it wouldn't cause memory loss or put a physical burden on her. What should we do? Hey, don't you know a doctor? You do. Can you contact them? A house call is gonna cost you, you know. How much will it be? That was a joke. So, um, how is her condition? Her pulse, breathing, temperature, and blood pressure are all normal. No ocular abnormalities either. I'm not sure why, but it seems this girl is in some kind of light stupor. Furthermore, she lacks muscle for her age. I doubt she has much stamina either. I see. The rebound from her awakening was too strong. There may have been too many abnormal circumstances. We simply cannot keep quiet about this. We should let Boss know. Wouldn't he figure out our identities? Still, we should tell him, shouldn't we? Wait for now. What if nothing happens until it's too late? Letting him know is really the only option we have. I guess it can't be helped now. Just keep the circumstances that led up to this a secret, okay? Hey, Futaba? Hey! <sighs> oh dear. Uh, um, about Futaba. Hmm? Well, why do you guys look so down? Futaba chan's condition. What, this? It happens every so often. Huh? She must have used up all her energy. It's like she ran out of batteries. I think it happens because she doesn't get enough exercise. What? She stays like this for a few days whenever this happens. I'll make sure she gets plenty of rest. Here, keep an eye on her. I'm gonna go close the store. It's hard to describe how I feel right now. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty frustrated. I'm glad she's okay, but what are we gonna do about Medjed? Uh, she's up! Mm, Medjed... Uh, 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 tired. Gonna sleep for a bit. She fell asleep again?! futaba -chan? For a bit? How much is she planning on sleeping? We probably shouldn't wake her up, either. What to do? It's too late for us to find another hacker. All we can do is wait for her to wake up. Bad, the cleanse is fast approaching. We're not gonna make it if we don't come up with a solution. Speaking about Medjid shit, people talk about those leaks everywhere I go. The news is starting to tighten around our necks. Probably will save us. 
that my house was in a dangerous put all eggs in one basket. Our only saving grace is that Medjet seems quite intent on sticking to their planned date. We just gotta keep trying till the day comes, yeah? Yes, yeah, so there's no point in complaining about it now. Let's continue our efforts. <laughs> Chief's with her. I'm sure everything will be okay. Just gotta wait for Taba to wake up. Uh, another reason not to do that because now freaking Captain Hardass is not at the store. We can't possibly hang out with him. And yes, eat. Suki, eat. Nice. I saw that, but uh, I wanted to let the whole okay. sequence play out before talking again. Hey! What? Seriously requesting massage? Uh, I love you know I trained while working with Victoria. My skills are amazing. How's the pressure, Master? Press down on this area, it hurts so much. Oh, you just fidgeted a little, didn't you? Master! Oh! See you later! Thursday night. Mm -hmm. I see here. Everyone. Good evening. Oh, sweet. Yeah, let's hang out with Yoshida. Hell yes. Actually, I am in Matsushita. Asked me to meet after this. Remember how he asked me to become his right-hand man? Well, he likely wants my answer. I need you to come with me after the speech. What's wrong? You asked me here to discuss. I heard you met with Kuramoto's grandson. You have your ears to the ground, huh? I think he's the candidate the party is backing to ruin my chances of winning. I'll be completely straight with you, since I already asked you to be my right-hand man. We're currently fighting the Kuramoto group. What? Fighting with Mr. Kuramoto? I have ambitions of my own, you know? I know him for all he did for me, but I don't want him to have influence over me forever. All the more, that's why he's secretly working with diet members from other parties. I know he asked you to join his group, but I, I think you should decline his offer. Hmm. I want to keep you on a leash so you won't reveal any damaging information. Real culprit of expense misappropriation case. You were blamed for his old man, Kuramoto. What in the world? What did you say? I searched through the party's off-the-record accounts from 20 years ago. There's no doubt. But can you still forgive him? He led you into the political world and kicked you out in the worst way. Why? Seems he, he bought his popularity, and as a result, he's having some serious financial trouble. I see. As if you're saying this is my opportunity to clear my name. So you need an answer from me on whether I'll be your right-hand man, yes? His own grandson has already tried to persuade you, therefore I can't wait any longer. If you join me, you can accuse Kuramoto of his crime. Clear your name and put no good Torah behind you. This is your best and last chance. Join with Matsushita and take my revenge against Mr. Kuramoto, but drop out of the election. Difficult decision. Yes. Say the least. Matsushita, I appreciate the offer, but I must refuse. You have no conceivable reason to refuse. My goal is to become a member of the Diet, not a right-hand man. I will not cast aside my beliefs. On that, I stand firm. This information would be the deciding factor in taking down Kuramoto. I'm sorry. Don't worry about it. I was simply offering you a deal. I assumed you might decline it. 
Very well, please forget it. I apologize for bringing it up so suddenly. I'll support. I'll talk to the party and provide support for your next speech about the Phantom Thieves. Hmm? Why are you doing this? I don't want to debate about the Phantom Thieves. I simply want to draw attention to them. You can assert your innocence there on the on a grand stage. To be frank, I'd be I'll be happy as long as Kuramoto's group of influence diminishes. Red, don't speak a word of this to anyone for both our sakes. Very well then. <sighs> Feels like I'm caught in the crossfire of a political conspiracy. Yeah, pretty much. A friend is trying to take advantage of me while my former mentor is trying to win me over. Achieve my dream, I have to set aside my beliefs. What should I do? Stick to your beliefs. Yes. Right. Betraying, my, betraying myself means betraying my supporters, which also means betraying you. For some reason, just talking with you always helps me make up my mind. But my heart is being manipulated. Hmm. Perhaps. Phantom Thieves truly do exist, and I'm sure they're very much like you. For some reason, you stood by me. No good Torah, who didn't have any Naturally. supporters. I've been thinking about this for a while, actually. You must have experienced cruelty and injustice in this life. I can tell by the look in your eyes. That's why I sense your help, your desire to help the weak. The strength to stand up to the hecklers, to Mosh Matsushita, and to Kuramoto's grandson. You're an ordinary high school student. Even I know that much. Hey. Do you care to talk about it? Good with that, do. <laughs> Just a joke. Oh, sorry, across the line there. I've always lacked restraint in these situations. What I did there, I relieved the tension by making fun of myself. Think of it as an advanced technique for winning people over. Bind control occasionally lets you skip negotiation when attempting to obtain a persona. All right. Right. All right, then. Well, I'll at least make good use of Matsushita's help setting up my next speech. I feel like I'll be able to fully express my beliefs if you're there I with me. I shall ask you again we'll another discuss it again in the speech. Or we could... Yeah. Right, right. Well, then, I'll see you again. Goodness for tagging along today. Thank you for tagging along today. Goodness, I've got you wrapped up in my, my whole messy past now. I told you before, becoming a diet member should be your only goal in life. I'll stand by those words, of course. What are your thoughts on what happened today? Hey, your views. Could you say with all confidence that you wouldn't be swayed by such a lucrative deal? Humans are easily swayed. One glimpse, one glimpse of a temptation can be all it takes to make us forget our principles. That is why you must never forget what's truly important to you. You understand? Never forget that. Life is full of tough decisions. I can only hope today's lesson will nourish your growth. Well, the real battle begins now. I need to devote myself to this fully. After all, I can hardly afford to disappoint you. All right, see you next time. I'll be counting on you. Hi! Thank you for waiting. Here you go. Oh. We're almost 38% uh, approval rating. And this is crazy. I can't keep up with this constant influx of posts. Isn't it tough being popular? Anyway, here's the latest lead I have. This one seems to be about someone abusing their power. I wonder if it's written by a former employee of the company in question. Anyway, one of the higher-ups has been claiming the achievements of his subordinates as his own. It really sucks. Some business sense. You can't seriously just be accepting of that. Now I know the name of the company, but I don't have any details on the person himself. The company's over in Shinjuku, so try asking around places where businessmen can hang out. Bar at night might be a good place to start. That should be a good place to get more info on the situation. I hope this isn't asking much of you. Sorry, I'll look for another one just in case. Aren't we just your slaves? Right. 
Okay, so. Kodo and Ryuji are both available today to hang out. Nice. Looks healthy. Okay, boss is back. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay, let's see, it's Friday. Actually, hold on a sec, let me... Okay. Called them into the hideout just to discuss and make sure that I get the... Uh, Everyone's cleared. here. Just your slaves. Put that Shinjuku bar to investigate. Okay. Alright hey guys, I was telling you here to look at that. So, I'm guessing I have to go to the jazz club at night, because that's Shinjuku, right? No, no. I'm thinking of Kichioji. So, I need to go to the bar in Shinjuku at night, okay. Uh, okay. feel like I'll use Makoto in the next dungeon, so I should rank her up. That I'm using Skate to locate a card for me while I'm kind of. Hmm. By the way. I see. Eight. 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 Please. Very well. Well then. Okay, we got to four. Oh. Nice. I don't have to keep back of some cards. Wow, but she gets follow up the next rank, so we're definitely gonna rank her up today. with Justine you handled you want to register are you sure read here wait it was the priestess up top yes, yes it was is this what you want a fee is required this is your power are you finished what it is time inmate Well, it's not a 
chat with her. But first things first, I'm going to refill my drink and use the restroom. Hydration is important. Also, I think I may. I think Futaba's Palace might actually be my favorite with that final fight. had a practice exam, entrance exam, and my score was significantly lower than last time. I'm concerned. Unlike you. Couldn't agree more. Actually... The, question is, the truth is, I recently started questioning the entire point of my education. But do I stand to gain from getting good grades and living up to the high expectations my sister has set for me? I spoke to Iku about the matter as well, but the answer hasn't become any clearer. Uh... Iko? Hmm? I don't remember Iko Ako Chan. Anyway, we call each other every so often since we exchange contact information. Because of those calls, we've actually grown somewhat close. When I voiced my concerns to her, she asked me how I would benefit from going to a top university. But I couldn't come up with a good answer. As for Tako Chan, her grades are not the best. But she claims she doesn't even think about that stuff. Apparently, her parents can use their connections to find her a job. Hmm. Isn't that a little irresponsible? It's nice to say she can rely on her parents, but this is her life, not theirs. I guess it's just a different way of approaching things. Even at that, her vision of the future is still clearer than mine. Uh, that does not sound like a very clear vision at all. I mean, hmm. I used to think doing what others expected me was the best way forward. I'm going. I was going to major in law, just like my sister did. After that, I simply would have headed down whatever path society had made for me. But... Everything changed when I joined the Phantom Thieves. I realize now there are more important things in life than just being a prim and proper honor student. Honestly, I looked down on Ego's line of thinking in the past, but I know better now. Speaking of... <laughs> must have known I was talking about her. Lately, she's been telling me whenever her, she buys makeup or finds a cute new outfit. Reminds me, she asked me the other day what hand cream I use. Sent her a picture, it's apparently the same brand they use in the nurse's office at school. Uh, why do you use it? Yes. Stuff works wonders for dry skin, and it's great value, too. Actually... My father used to use it all the time. Did I ever tell you he was a police officer? That's that the corruption or society worked tirelessly to bring it to justice. But despite the rough exterior, he was extremely gentle deep down. That reminds me. When I was little, I told him I wanted to grow up to be a police officer just like he was. He was glad to hear me say that, but quick to point out that he didn't want me doing something so dangerous. I'd completely forgotten about that dream, to be honest. Uh, let's not come on too heavy. Do you still want to pursue it? Hmm. I don't know, I mean, I only barely remembered it just now. Either way, after everything that happened, I have no intention of working with the police. But if they're trying to stop the Phantom Thieves, what am I supposed to do? Arrest myself? But you could be our inside woman. I think I may need to re-examine what my goals for the future are outside of just plain studying. Thank you very much. You know, it feels like I remembered something important thanks to you. I guess you could say my viewpoint has been broadened yet again. Let's resolve from the Kodo. There we go, follow up. All right. Hey. I'm not Aiko, I just realized how narrow my viewpoint really was. I only just recently learned that a... Uh, Jamise is now called a camisole and a button-down sweater is a cardigan. It's the same thing, I have to have multiple names. I know, right? I guess in the end, I'm just becoming more aware of how little I really know. So please help me keep fighting back against that ignorance. I'll see you later. 